Dolly. She's our little dog. I love her. Archer. Our dog Tur, that's what we call her instead of a daughter because we don't really plan on having kids anytime we're soon. We're uh, No, we're not. <laughs> I mean, I'm nervous before weddings. I don't know why. I guess it's, I guess I just build myself up for before, you know, what if this goes wrong, what if that goes wrong. She thinks of every possible situation that can go wrong and plays it out in her head. And of course it's you know, just, it wreaks havoc on But that's why we're good together because I'm a little more high strung and he's more relaxed. You know, I, t I usually take the groom aside and take some pictures of just him, and I always tell him, you guys are going to do great, you're a good couple. Um, why are you laughing? No, that's so sweet. I didn't um, know you did that. I, I do. I do that with all of our grooms. Cool. Andy and Jessica were our bride and groom. She was very reserved and wanted everything to go proper, and then Andy was wild. He likes to drink and likes to party. His family likes to drink and party, so I knew we'd have some fun there. I think they're a great couple. They're very outgoing. Um, was my explanation that good? Well, honey, uh, you just you kind of rambled. Yeah. I love you. But... I don't know what exactly to expect because you really don't know what's going to happen throughout the day. We're going through our getting our cameras ready before we step into the church. And I know our big zoom lens is not there. <gasps> what? You didn't bring my lens. What? What lens? My zoom lens, dude. Well, run home and get it. There was no other way to say it. I first noticed it to was me, gone, and I thought she's going to be you mad. You know what this is like. When you're a boss, you don't, and I'm not trying, I don't know how else to say She it. is the boss. Well, before the first dance, we went outside to shoot some pictures out on the dock. Couldn't find Andy at first. He was outside changing his shoes. There he is, right there. There is the groom! Oh my God. All right. Well, I was frustrated because, you know, her mom had specifically asked, you know, are you gonna get a sunset shot? So when it came down to the minute, I mean, the sunset only happens for a couple minutes. So it's like, okay, we need to get out there now. And then we went to out go. to the uh, rickety dock. And that thing just shook oh back and gosh, forth. I know. And there's there's Sarah and I out there, you know, and then the, one of the groomsmen came out trying to take a picture also. I wasn't worried about them falling. I'm, I was worried more worried I about I was them. worried when I was on that dock that I was going to fall in. Or you were going to fall in. I walked away from some of the things like, God. You know, what a fiasco at times. Although the fiasco is going around, we're trying not to have a fiasco on the film. They're going to see those pictures and feel that moment again with each other and not think about anybody else. Yeah, we want it to look like they had the perfect day regardless of what happened. I think we do a good job. I do a stellar job. You do a good job. You do a good job. Boss. <laughs> <laughs>